On a beautiful day like this, what do you want to do? Hang out outside and definitely learn a thing or two. Welcome in the new season. And that is what Tinker Garden is doing here in Elk Grove. Right now we're at the Elk Grove Wildlife Refuge. And we are taking part in one of their classes because tonight there is a lantern walk to welcome in that good season. Brand new season. I know we don't want it. We don't want the fall. We don't want the winter. But you know what? <laughs> It's okay, right, Christina? It is. We don't, in Tinker Garden, we don't think about seasons as a whole. And every season you can play outside. And that's what we encourage at Tinker Garden. There's no bad weather, yeah. just bad clothing. <laughs> so if you dress properly, you can come out. So for our fall lantern walk, we really want to celebrate that. And with that, we are creating lanterns. Yes. And you know what, folks? You can come and join them. And what time is that? It's at 4 o'clock at Elk Grove Regional Park. And it's for about an hour. And we're just going to watch as the sun goes down. And we celebrate. And we sing a few songs to kind of celebrate the change of the season. Yeah. And it's free. So that's the best part about it. And you get to meet people in the community, which is wonderful as well. And it is fun for the family to and come on out. It's a big family event, which yeah. is really nice for us. But here's the thing, Christina. I don't know how to make a lantern. I have no idea, which is why I decided to stop in in this class here early this morning. Um, what, do, what do I need? What do, what do I got going on over here? So we just need a simple jar, and if you're at home and you're crafty, you can just use your recycled ragu container or spaghetti container or anything you've got, salsa container if you're in my house, and a little bit of glue water mixture, which is what we have right here, Okay. and then just some cut-up paper scraps. Now, if you have old newspapers, you can use that as well, which is totally fine, and then you just kind of glue it on. And now the, the best thing about this is it's not about the it's, it's about the process not the procedure so it's not about our end product it's about what we get from doing something together in nature yeah and all of this is very easy to buy um and you know some of these things are easy to find at home so it's not going to cost a lot of money um and it's definitely something fun to do with the kids definitely. isn't that right it is it's definitely something that kids of any age can do um doesn't take a lot of skill level. If you don't have a paintbrush, you can use your hands. So it works. It's it's an easy thing for any kid. All right. Well, there you go. And you can go on their website and check out. They have amazing classes as well. So you can bring your kids out here to learn a thing or two and come out tonight because it'll definitely be a wonderful, wonderful moment for everybody to enjoy. I'll toss it back to you all in the studio. Thank you. All right. So what? Can we what? And just put a little bit on.